In JavaScript, it's incredibly common to map between two values such as user IDs and user objects, but this is not the best way to do that. Instead, you should use an actual map object. So we could create a new map, and a new map just takes an array of arrays, so each array represents your items. So in our case, we could say here, the key is gonna be one and the value is going to be Kyle. And if I copy down this as well, we can just put this inside of an array and we'll get the exact same result. So now what I can do is I can take my user map, I can print this out, and you can see we get a map that's mapping between these different values. So you can see the key of one goes to the value of Kyle, and we have here the key of two going to the value of Sally. Now the reason these maps are so useful is it makes it really easy to do certain things. As you can see, we can clear all the entries, delete specific ones, loop through them all, we can set an individual entry, and we can use things that aren't just strings and numbers. For example, I could say the user ID one is going to map to the name here of John, and now if we look inside of our map, we can see that we have an object that's the key mapping to another object. 